Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you all are doing well. So I feel like I haven't sat and done a fashion haul in so long. It could only be a few months, but still that's long enough. So I actually went into Zara last week, I think it was, and found about nine pieces, and which is very rare I think these days because normally I'm buying one thing from one shop, one thing from another, or just shopping permanently on Pretty Little Thing. But I actually went in and found, well actually, I say me, Will actually went in and found, and if you do follow me on Instagram, I did put on my stories that he actually said in Zara out loud that he felt like Kanye West. I thought okay, and I was actually really glad that nobody was around us because he didn't laugh after he said it. So he was being really serious. <laughs> but yes, yeah, so I've got about nine things to show you today. I'm actually wearing one of them, which I'll show you in a minute, because I'm just so obsessed with this. Yeah, so we'll just get straight into the video, and I really hope that you like some of the things that I've found. So like I said, the first thing that I wanted to show you was this nude bodysuit. Um, I have bought this before. I think this is the second one I've had, because I wore it to death wore it to death and um, they're only 12.99 the material is so so nice they're super super stretchy it's a bodysuit like i've just said um i have this in black i was trying to get it in white but i couldn't find it in my size in the shop or online um i know they do have it in a fair few colors um but honestly these are staple for me at the minute and they're good for layering uh come autumn and i'm just a huge fan of them to be fair um, I know other places are kind of doing similar ones, but for me, can't beat the Zara ones at the minute. Just super, super comfortable, and I literally could wear them every day. <laughs> so next up in the haul is I have these black cargo trousers. They're quite thin material, they've got a cuff bottom. Um, everything I brought in this haul as well was in a size small. These were £25.99. Um, so any, and also anything that I can find, because obviously I bought all these from the shop, so anything that I find online, I'll link everything down in the description box for you below. Um, but yeah, so I bought these because I wanted something different to wear other than cycling shorts, joggers or jeans. Because <laughs> at the minute, that's all I'm reaching for. So I wanted just a little bit of a different trouser. And they do have them in, I think, a bit of a dark grey. So I think if I wear these enough, I might get the dark grey ones. I actually brought these to go with everything that I bought in the haul as well, which for me is just easier to shop that way um, because if I'm ever rushing around, I know that all of my clothes kind of go together. I don't know if anybody else shops like that, but I do. <laughs> um, so yeah, let's try these on and see what we think. Okay, so these are the black trousers. Um, they fit so nicely. I feel like I've got a lot of room in them, but they're not too um, they're not too big to where they look unflattering. So yeah, they look really really nice. Feel really comfortable, really soft. Um, I feel like I've got enough room when I sit down. Um, yeah, so I'm really happy with them. But this is a, um, a fake button, by the way, so that doesn't undo. But you've got a lot of elastic around the back. But yeah, really like these. Hopefully they look nice with everything I've bought. <laughs> so next up in the haul, we have this white basic top. What I love most about this is it's a really nice twist on a really basic white t-shirt because it's got these padded shoulders and the arm is quite deep there, so it goes really low. And it also has a stretchy hem at the bottom of the top. So like I said, it's just a really nice twist on a regular basic t-shirt. So let's see what we think of this. Okay, so this is the white t-shirt. I absolutely love it. I think it fits so well. If I, if I haven't mentioned, this was just 7 99 And I love that that's really like low. I love that quite that, um, little detail. But yeah, I really like the shoulder pads. That's not too tight around my stomach. And again, just kept it on with these black trousers. But yeah, all in all, I think really nice and like I said just a bit of a different take just on a plain white t-shirt yeah I feel really nice and I feel like this whole outfit it's quite relaxed but I could even I could put my Doc Martens on with it or my trainers or even just some sandals or literally anything you could literally put anything with this outfit but yeah it's really really nice okay so next up keeping in theme with our basic t-shirts I actually brought one in this beautiful like mauvey colour still got the same um, like padded shoulders but this one is a 
uh, boxed fit t-shirt instead of the stretchy hem. I just love the colour. I thought it was really, really nice and it can go with a lot of stuff in my wardrobe. Um, so yeah, let's see what we think of this one. Okay, so this is the mauve coloured t-shirt. I actually really love this colour against like my skin tone. I think it's really flattering. Um, again, love these um, detailed shoulder pads. Um, I've took this one in because like I said, it is a box fit t-shirt. Um, but yeah, I really, really like it. It's just, uh, just something different, but I feel quite nice with the trousers again. <laughs> Literally just going to wear these trousers with every single <laughs> item you uh, see me wearing. Um, but yeah, I really, really like it. Fits really nice. The material is really soft as well. It's like soft cotton. Um, but yeah. Okay, so the last of the tops in our haul is again like a deep... What colour is this? It's like a mauvey raspberry colour I don't really know um, but it's a bodysuit I'm obsessed with bodysuits I would wear a bodysuit every single day but it's really nice because I love the lace detail that it's got at the front and you can definitely just wear this with jeans or some leather leggings as such if you've been following me on here for a while you know that I'm just obsessed with leather leggings I'm coming into autumn so they're coming in, they are going to be coming back out very very soon and my leather shorts <laughs> so yeah I just thought this is really nice for layering as well um, leather jackets, denim jackets literally absolutely anything so let's see what we think of this okay this is the mauve coloured like, bodysuit with the lace detail it fits so nicely like I said I've got everything in a small but it just fits really nice it's really comfortable it's not too tight like underneath the hair as well um, yeah, it just fits really, really nice. I know they have these in a few other colours. I might get another one. Um, but yeah, I think, like I said, they look really nice again with these trousers. But I'm actually going to quickly show you why I bought this and see if the um, outfit actually looks nice. One second. So this was exactly how I intended to wear the outfit. Come back a bit so you can see it. So with black blazer, my blue mum jeans and Doc Martens, just pretend there's another one on there, I can't be bothered to put it on my prosthetic. <laughs> and my cute little bag um, from HA Designs. This is when I saw it, this was the whole outfit that I had in mind. So, I actually quite like it. Yeah, what do you guys think? So this is how I wanted to wear it. But yeah, really happy with it. Okay, so next up in the haul, we have this beautiful, snuggly, chunky knit jumper. I don't know about you, but I feel like it's getting really cold. And I don't feel like it's normally like that in August to knit, well, no, we're in September now. But like the beginning of September, I'm pretty sure it's normally quite warm, but it's getting freezing. So that's why I wanted to buy a thick jumper. <laughs> but I love that it's got like balloon sleeves. Um, I think it just adds an extra little bit of detail there. Um, so yeah, let's see what we think of this one. Okay, I'm in, so in love with this jumper. It's actually unreal. Look at the sleeves. Oh my God. I love this so, so much. It's so snuggly and it's soft. The worst thing you can get when you buy a jumper is if it's itchy. I feel like when it's got alpaca in, H&M jumpers are notorious for having alpaca in. So if you get it and you try it and it's itchy, it's because of that reason. I find it really irritating for my skin. But this is soft so so soft and for 30 pounds as well i swear it was 29.99 i'll double check that but oh my god and i've tucked it in with these trousers i think again they look lovely with these trousers i'll probably put this on with a pair of dot martins shock because i love my dot martins wearing with every single outfit <laughs> um but yeah absolutely love it i love how chunky the neck is as well but yeah really really like this and i have tucked it in but the detail at the bottom is like that but yeah really love this Okay, this is one of my favourite things I bought out of the whole entire haul. Um, and it's the only dress that I actually bought, but I don't know how it's going to look on, so I really hope it looks nice on as it does off. <laughs> um, but it's this nude dress, and it's got ruching at the waist, and then it's got this really nice pleated dart at the back. I don't know if you can see that detail, but yeah, it's got that at the back. Um, this dress was £25.99 and it's in a really thick linen, I would say, but it's, it definitely has some stretch in there. 
so I just really like the overall look and I really like the um, big pocket details that everything seems to have on at the minute in Zara um, and pretty much some other shops as well that I've seen but yeah so let's try this on and see what we think okay guys this is the cream dress and I've got to admit I'm not loving it this is how I wanted to wear it I wanted to wear it obvs with my Louis leg and my Louis bag but it's just not doing anything for me let me put that down I feel like it's pulling all in the wrong places even though it's got that there it was a struggle to get over my hip as you can see look at that hem it's already twisting so I would need the bigger size and it feels massive up here it's yeah I think this is going to have to go back and I had such high hopes for this dress. Like I said, it was literally the favorite, my favorite thing that I bought. But I'm just not, I don't feel comfortable in this at all. So yeah, oh. Okay, next up in the haul. I know that I said the dress was one of my favorite pieces, but I really actually love this jacket. Um, it's not got a tag on because I've already worn it. I literally wore it the first day I bought it. <laughs> but it was 29.99, I got it in a small. Um, it fits so nice but it's perfect for layering like so perfect it's got so much room so I actually worn this with a uh, white hoodie underneath it looked really really nice um, but yeah I ha hadn't got a you know like a waterproof jacket in my wardrobe so I really needed one and obviously it's in my favourite colour green so that's why I purchased this so I will show you what this looks like now okay guys this is the windbreaker jacket oh my god i love this jacket so much i'm pretty sure they had it in black as well but it's me had to go for the green but yeah so i've just popped it on with this um white hoodie obviously keeping on the black trousers and i've got some white air force ones on with it this is how i would probably wear it or maybe just like an all black casual outfit with just this on top um but yeah really like it it's really nice it's got a lot of room in so you can lay it up as much as possible so yeah that is the jacket and it has a hood right there okay last but certainly not least in our zara haul is this beautiful leather jacket i already have a leather jacket but i really needed another one my old one was quite thin whereas i love that this is slightly thicker slightly more boxy so i can get a jumper underneath it um this was 50 pounds i've already worn this as well so it's got a tag on i got it in a size small um but yeah the only thing i don't really like about this it had a belt but the belt keeps slipping off like it, it's not got like a button at the back to hold it in place like one of my other jackets has got um so i might have to like put a little button in so it holds the belt so i don't really know where the belt is it's gone around somewhere but it's really really nice and they had two styles to choose from but i chose this one because i actually really like that little like pocket that they've got and um it's different on both sides which that's one of the features that i like the most everyone needs a leather jacket if you don't have a leather jacket then you need to get one don't matter what your style is a leather jacket suits absolutely everyone and it is staple so you need one to get one <laughs> okay so this is the leather jacket i've got i didn't mention already i got it in a small when it was 50 pounds um but it's the jacket is oversized enough to fit on this hoodie that's why i kept it on so you can see how um thick you can get things under uh, but I've just kept it on with that same outfit just for ease um, but yeah like I said staple everyone needs a leather jacket in their lives um, I managed to find the belt so I can show you that but yeah it just keeps slipping out so it's just it would have been good with like either suede on the inside so it wouldn't move or they could have just put a button in the back so it wouldn't slip off um, but I'll probably have to do something about that because I actually do like it with the belt on but yeah we will see so yeah that is the last item okay guys that is everything in the zara haul i really hope that you've liked the pieces that i've chosen please comment below on what your favorite item was and like i said i will leave everything in the description box below so thank you so much for watching and don't forget to subscribe and i will see you in my next video